Hello. Hold up, I'm gonna change that. Hello? Gain? That's better. Okay. Hi, and welcome to the first Tea Time Podcast, episode... Something or another. The first Tea Time Podcast? First Tea Time... No, the first Tea Time Podcast recorded... Live. Not live. The other ones were live. This is when me and Zach are in the same room. Yep. 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 Been a while since we've done one of these, but we're back. Plus, I'm on my phone. Hang on. Just got Turn that shit Well, you didn't tell me you were doing that. I know. I want to be a surprise. Well, it was. Yep. Well, there's a lot of things that's happened to us since the last time that we've done a podcast. We started three new shows, probably. I don't know. I'm bad at counting. Uh, we've... Um, I went to Alaska. Zach stayed home. Probably did other stuff. Probably what? Nothing. Nothing. Uh, no, say it, Simon. Not what? Was, what did I do? <laughs> Jerk off. Is that what you're going to say? Great, because I'm trying to be... This is a, this is a child-friendly program, Zach. What are we going to do? We're going to get shut down by the NSA. By the TSA. Well, you said so much crap on here, Simon. Don't I know. Don't but you either. The main Freaking. reason I'm trying to clean up this show is because I want to have some stuff that, you know, anyone could watch. And other stuff that, you know... Only people our age and above should watch. Yeah. So, this is supposed to be one of those shows. So, what? Which one of those? The first one. The what about the room. episodes where we talk about pedophiles and murderers? Th that's fine. That's important knowledge that everyone should have. That's true. So, uh, just like not scream cuss words. At, like, the top of our lungs like the Mario Kart series that's true which is that's the whole purpose of that series is to like blatantly curse because it's fun yeah which we should play we should we could play that with two CPUs actually yeah that'd be fun so I went to Alaska which was fun mhm mm uh I saw a lot of things there including Alaska <laughs> and uh some other places saw Canada out the window of my plane yeah which was exciting yeah uh but let me tell you about what happened uh there's some 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 fun stuff some yeah. some harsh stuff some uh troubles that on that we went that we underwent uh like so those mosquitoes yeah fucking they're huge i bet yeah so I'll give you the rundown from start to finish. Wake up early. Mm -hmm. Out of, not this bed, my other bed at my <laughs> father's house. Uh, and I, actually, I think I packed the night before, which is very unprecedented yeah. of me because I have, a, I have a rule where I only pack the first five minutes before we leave right. because I know I can do it and just to prove a point. Mm -hmm. And usually I do it, but this time I didn't. I think it's because your Nana told you to pack the night before. <laughs> yeah. And she was also in the room. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, uh, after that, we drive to the plane airport, uh, and we get on the plane. It's all fine. You know, we're kind of in the around the same area, which mm -hmm. is good on the way there. Uh, then uh, played some Zelda. Talk about that later. I actually, finished the game. All right. Oh, okay. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Oh. Then. Um, on the plane, they gave us, I, I think I ate breakfast, like a small breakfast. Yeah. But they gave us like a little snack box, because, you know, it's not like a full flight, so you don't get like an actual meal, you just right. get a little snack box. Did you get alcohol? No, that's illegal. Wow. Oh. Yeah. Well, you yeah. Know. But, to tell you what I did get, gummy worms. Not gummy worms, gummy bears. I was mistaken. Really? Yes. So, gummy bears, here's the thing, I was a little hungry. So, my stomach was, like, grumbling a little bit. Yeah. But I didn't really feel too hungry. But immediately, when I ate the first gummy bear, like, there was just this gut-wrenching pain. And it went Jeez. through my entire stomach area. And I just, like, w like curled up in a ball in my seat. God. And I felt awful. Sounds awful. Yeah, it was. And that's, like, the only exciting thing. How Let's long is your flight? Uh, pfft couple hours not long 
So Alaska. Once we got Alaska. there, we had a little bit of trouble. We got uh, my dad wanted a double up on the uh, whole Kararuski situation. Mm -hmm. uh, not double up as in like uh, cars, as in the size of the car. Uh -huh. But they're like, this is all we got, and it was a pretty spacious like little car. It was about my stuff. It's about my car. Yeah. So, uh, but a little bit bigger. Uh, then, uh, we got to the house, we were airbnb mm -hmm. Then, uh, sorry, too many carrots. Uh, then, once we got there, here's the deal deal. The, they didn't give us that house, house key. It was oh. like a number thing. Yeah. And Dad was trying to like contact them through the app. Yeah. And it was like, Dad, just use the number. And we we're like... Did you not hear me knock? We, yeah, we did, but... We were fine. Oh, I, should, I, I did. Are you on, on the air? Yeah. Sorry. Good job. Bye. Thanks. Time code 950. <laughs> 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 All right, I'm gonna have to start doing that with the episodes now. That's actually a good idea. Yeah. So I don't have to edit them. I just write down the time code. Right. All right. Uh, so once we got there, they didn't have the key. So uh, Dad called them. Not called them. He texted them through the app, which was a dumb idea because they didn't respond. It was like, Dad, just text their number. Don't you get that? It's yeah. Like, yeah, but I don't want to seem rude. And I'm like. That sounds like something I would do. God. Yeah. And I had a little freak out moment, and then my grandmother went ahead and like got the number off his phone and called him up and be like, "Hey, what up?" I think that's what happened. Anyways, we got in. Yeah. Uh, we. I think after that we did like a little sightseeing. We drove around. We went to this nice restaurant. It was uh, called Simon, and like it was a name close to Seymour, so it was kind of weird. Oh, cool. Yeah, it was like in a hotel restaurant. Mm -hmm. It was nice. I got a nice burger there. They, uh, it was it was pretty good quality. It's probably uh, top ten burger places. Really? Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, maybe fifteen. Hmm. Uh, but I think yeah. After that, we just went home. Uh, throughout uh, uh, Alaska, I was listening to some podcasts yeah. that I found on the internet, as you would do. You can't just, you know, tape your podcast and <laughs> sell them. That'd be kind of fun. Yeah. Uh, we sell a podcast at school, That'd just be like neat. being a little cassette tape. Yeah. <laughs> uh, game plan. Mm-hmm. Game theory. Ga game theory. But uh, there's this cool podcast called Cool Games, Inc., and it's by the guys of Polygon, uh, and uh, the podcast like premises. And this podcast doesn't have a premise. It's just two guys talking. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, we just do. We just say stuff, and it's fun. Uh, but their whole premise is that they uh, get Twitter suggestions and create games about that suggestion. Okay. So it's kind of popular, uh, and. It's really funny, actually. And they get, like, uh, guest stars and stuff. Like, video games or, like... Video games, yeah. Oh, okay. Like, uh, and it's... Uh, like, an example would be... Uh, sometimes they start with a title, sometimes they start with a concept. Uh, one example would be Hugh Jackman's Huge Actin. Okay. As a game. And it's a VR game where uh, you act. Yeah. Out, but... Um, but you have to audition to get into roles. Okay. And, but it's super expensive, that's the thing. Uh, but it, no, it's a free-to-play, but, like, to get into roles, yeah. it's expensive. Okay. But also, there's an alternative route where you, like, work hard and, like, slowly build up your reputation so that then you don't have to pay as much to, to get into games. Right. To get into shows. That's interesting. Yeah. So I, that's one of the more recent ones that I watched. Uh, but it's really good. Uh, and that's our new subject. Se segment of the show. Podcast recommendations. If you don't like this one, ah, listen to another one. Interesting. If you don't like this one, listen to our other pod. Wait, I deleted it. Never mind. We had a D&D &D podcast. Oh, yeah, and that didn't go very well. 
but we're bringing it back. We're bringing it back. Hopefully tonight. Yeah. Actually, after this. Yeah. Uh, and after we eat. Mm-hmm. So, hopefully. Hopefully. We might starve. I'd rather not. Yeah, me too. Uh, let's see. Alaska. I saw some animals. Yeah. I saw nature. Yeah. Uh, I saw some pictures, and I took pictures. Yeah. Uh, I went to a glacier, and it was really cold. And the funny thing was, we got the cheapest option. Yeah. And we just ran around and stuff, and it was fine. But there were other people that got the more expensive option. So they got, like, cleats on their shoes, like metal ones, so yeah. they could stamp it to the ice, which obviously sounds fun, but that's $100 per person. Right. Versus $25 per person. That's kind of ridiculous. Yeah. But you also get a tour guide. And that's dumb. Yeah, no. Uh, no. I, I want to go on my own. Yeah. So, but it, the funny thing was, uh, the people that got the tour guide and stuff, they kept on looking over at us and seeing how much fun we were having just walking around on, yeah. the, on the ice and give us these, like, scowling looks. Jeez. It was like, why did we pay for this? Can't yeah. believe it. Because they're rich and they can they can spend the money. Yeah. Rich people. Fucking rich people. Yeah. We make 50 cents. Yeah, that's our salary. Five years. <laughs> We, we get 10 cents a year, but we have to uh, mm-hmm. split it up. Mm-hmm. Bills. Got bills. those bills. Mm-hmm. One day, maybe, this will contribute somewhat. Uh, but that's about it. I did see some bears, three. Yeah. One mama bear and two cubs. That's cool. I saw a moose. Moose. Uh, a couple of meese. Yeah. As the plural is pronounced. Uh-huh. Uh, the, uh, yes. Time yeah, to move here. Yes. Uh, it's fifteen thirty. Okay. Yeah, let's crack open a cold <laughs> one with, with the boys. The boys. Mm. Crack open a boy with the cold ones. We just got root beer from our sponsor, Owen. This, this is, is a good one. sponsor. He sponsored us with root beer. Very fruity. I don't like it. It's odd. Yeah, I don't like this flavor. Whatever. It's root beer. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What well, it is. So, uh, Alaska. Alaska. It was, fun. It was cold. That's the thing. Yeah. It was, it's kind of weird coming back because I don't really know what to wear. Mm-hmm. Cause like sometimes I kind of feel like it's still Alaska, so I put on a couple layers and like. I remember before you left, I was like, it's going to be cold. And you were like, nah, it's summer. It won't be cold. And it was like... Oh, no, it's not as cold. That's the thing. Yeah. It gets, like, it's really like cold. It's very cold. Yeah. And the other thing about Alaska, you get four hours of nighttime. Really? Yeah. That's not a lot. Yeah, which is great for me, because... I like staying up and then sleeping for four hours. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so... A lot of podcasting and drawing on at night, which is usual, but I got to see in the daylight. Yeah, that's cool. So, uh, what else? Um, we went on this walk, which I thought was going to be indoors, but it was outdoors, so I only wore, like, one layer, <laughs> and let me tell you, I've never been more cold. <laughs> that's but, how it was in New York. Yeah? New York was really really cold oddly it was weird i did not expect it yeah it was like a different level of cold mm. than we have here in the south yeah i've never complained about being cold since then mm. like i think it was the wind yeah because it for some reason it was a lot windier than it's ever been here in my mm. life and it was so cold it doesn't matter how many layers you wore you would never be warm mm-hmm and DC was just as bad. Like you would, you could walk into, the, you could like face the wind and just let go of your body and lean into it, mm-hmm. and it would hold you up. Hmm. Like it was ridiculous. Crazy. Cold. Coldness. By jackets. Sponsored by jackets, jackets. everywhere. <laughs> you know, cardigans. Other options are available. Cardigans, sweaters, shawls, hoodies. Blankets, zipper blankets, snuggies, snuggies. <laughs> off-brand snuggies, off-brand snuggies, um, other other things, hats, gloves, earmuffs, 
Electric blankets. Electric blankets, yeah. 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 All Electric those. jackets. We got all of them to sponsor <laughs> we us. We have so many sponsors. <laughs> Uh, but they don't pay much, that's the thing. No, they don't. Like five cents each. That's we have, why we have so many. That's why we have, uh, that's why we have 50 cents. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> I want a sponsor. We hey. need a sponsor. Yeah. Hey, jacket companies right, and people. New face. Come sponsor. No, new, new, new. Hey, we can put IJU on a motherfucking hoodie. Yeah. And sell, sell that shit. Yeah. That's not a bad idea. Yeah. How about we just get a white hoodie and get a Sharpie and write IJU, like IJU. in, like, blue letters, because that's our official color. Yeah, blue. Yeah. And we can sell it. Mm-hmm. On the internet. And we can have an uh, an, an official IJRAMA t-shirt. Here. I'll draw it right now. I'll draw someone wearing it. Let's see. Here's a hoodie. Here's a hoodie. This root beer was the winner of the 1994 International Fancy Food and Confection Show's Outstanding Beverage Award. Must not be a very good award. <laughs> yeah. Or that, or they were better in 1994. Yeah. And 1996. Oh my gosh. They won it twice. There we go. There we go. I like it. Just what it says, right there. It looks great. I do you. Why does the guy wearing it look unhappy? Because he s saw that we didn't post anything for a week. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. Well, you know, but when we do, quality stuff. Yeah. Not it's like really. little nuggets of uh, quality. Little gold quality nuggets. You know, we got, we're got we in high school. So, yeah. You know, if, like, my young and prepubescent... Uh, voice doesn't tell you anything. <laughs> yeah. We're in high school. God, we sounded like such little babies when we started. Yeah. That's so bad. Do you ever, like, uh, sometimes I call Nate's voicemail just to hear his uh, tiny really? voice? Yeah. Because he, he doesn't recall, he doesn't respond any time. So, uh, I just hear it. Here, let's do it right now. <laughs> All right. Watch him pick up. That'd be the funniest. All right. Uh, let's find Nate. Uh... Hold up. Dennis Potter. It's a new phone. Oh, yeah, that's uh, someone I'm working with. Bye. Okay. What's your internship, by the way? Uh, I work... Uh, it's the thing I did last year. Oh, okay. At, at uh, Inside Out. Cool. Yeah, okay. So, Nate. That's a movie. Yeah. Sponsored by Inside Out, the movie. And the shop. Okay. Nate, bitch. What's his name? I'm at work right now, buddy. Oh, we're just trying to get your voicemail. <laughs> oh, okay. Sure, my bad. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Bye. I told you he would <laughs> <laughs> He never does. That's the thing. All right. He sounds like a man now. He called you buddy. Call me buddy. Buddy old pal. I'm at work right now, buddy. That's weird. Yeah. Interesting. I haven't heard his voice in years. Yeah, sometimes I watch the old videos, so I get his voice. It's from Enterprise, Alabama is the number. Huh. Your number? No, his number. Oh, that's weird. Yeah, it is. It's not from Alabama. Oh, fuck. So please leave a message. Goodbye. It was not Attention, please record your message. You when you finish recording, you may hang up or press one for... All right. I'll play it louder. Yeah. I didn't hear it. Through the well. magic. I heard it a little bit. But yeah. It's also on Alex's Instagram, like <laughs> our uh, ice bucket challenge. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah. I watched that. Why did he answer if he was at work? Did he answer why didn't just he to just, tell you yeah. he's at work? <laughs> He's like, I'm sorry, I got a job now. I'm a, an adult. He's, Ow. he's growing up. Yeah. He's going on up in the world. Mm -hmm. Leaving us behind. Yep. So, Alaska. Alaska. There's more stuff. Um, one thing about Alaska. Bring Bugsburg if you're ever wanting to go. God this damn. episode of Monster. IGU is sponsored by... <laughs> sponsored by bug spray Tea And time. mosquitoes. Yeah, both. I don't know how... I, I didn't think they looked up our other sponsors. Like, does he that we have bug spray sponsor? Yeah, they don't. No. 
It's like, hey, do you have bug spray for sponsor? No, 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 of course absolutely not. Absolutely not. No, but then I get more. I gotta get this one up uh, sponsored by it. Yeah. yeah. It's a shame. So everybody out there that runs those mosquito and or bug spray companies, hit us up. You know who to sponsor? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> God, I want to sponsor. Mm -hmm. But uh, bugs bring it because. Mosquitoes are huge. They're everywhere, and they can get through clothes. Yeah. That, really? Yeah. That's ridiculous. How big are they? They're, like, uh, about, I'd say half this, about maybe a quarter of the size of a, a large, uh, an adult cockroach. Jeez, that's huge. Yeah. Oh, my God. I don't, <laughs> God. That's ridiculous. Yeah. I was waiting on, I'd say, about the quarter of the size of a small dog. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, that'd be great. No, it wouldn't. It would be no, terrible. Wouldn't. Oh, my God. Uh, but the whole thing about that, I was like, hey, let's get bug spray. Because, like, everyone's like, I don't need bug spray. I got four layers on. And I was like, I want my hands and my face protected. Yeah. So I bought it. I also bought shampoo because... My hair is a wreck without shampoo. Mm -hmm. So is mine. Like, if I touch it, I can feel the grease of yeah. 11 different cultures. What? The grease, like, the combined grease. Gre grease. Oh, okay. Of 11 different oh, cultures. Okay. All combined into my hair. I get it. Yeah. I was like, you're, you're not that diverse. <laughs> <laughs> I get it, okay. Mm hmm. Mm. Well, in the meantime, while you were in Alaska, mm -hmm. I was at home being lonely because Dora was also gone. Oh, yeah. And then she got back, and I finally you know, hung out with her. But uh -huh. by then, you know, the damage was irreparable. Mm -hmm. I was emotionally scarred. I think you sent me a Snapchat of you lying in your shower just sitting there. Yeah, I was crying. Mm -hmm. Just my tears blended something. in with the water that was mm -hmm. running down my face anyway. So, so I can I can tell that you're crying because your eyes were all red. Yeah. Is you have that or some other things <laughs> like allergies in the shower? <laughs> Sponsored by allergies. Shower allergies. <laughs> Sponsored by showers. Showergies. That's what they're called. So all you people that run shower. Allergy companies out there, hit us up. You know who to talk to. Oh yeah, soon we're gonna end. Probably like tonight, we're gonna have a Facebook page. Oh yeah, IJU Facebook. So oh, because a lot of people use. I don't use Facebook. A lot of I use Facebook. I don't. I'm like the one person so that lets I know it. how to. Because I used it once, and I was like, I'm just gonna be myself, and then I realized people hate yourself. <laughs> uh, That's what your Instagram is for. Yeah, and your Snapchat. So. I had to lead to that, and I was like, yeah. Whatever. Yeah. So, I just use it for memes. I don't post anything. Mm -hmm. But yeah. hopefully... Ow. I have some stuff that I need to post, but I just didn't really want to. Yeah. Uh, but, okay, so... Flight home to Alaska. Complete atrocity. Wreck? Really? Yeah. Because here's why. Did you crash? Yes. We all died. I got resurrected though because you know I got that whole blood ritual sacrifice that thing. Does suck. Uh, so I'm I'm chill. Yeah. I had to like donate some of my blood to get uh, my family back. I don't really want to, but you know, if you kind of they, they would start asking questions. Yeah. If I was the only one back. So what actually happened? Why was it bad? Okay. So we were flying. We left early. Yeah. Around six. Yeah. Then we had to go through inspection. But here's the thing: we bought those are the culprits right there. Those candles. Yeah. So they saw them in the thing, and it was like, oh, I don't know what this is. So they took them out. So they had to search through all the all the bags, and they found candles. I was like, all right, it's fine. But that took so much time away that uh, we were running late uh, to our flight. So oh. we had to run to our flight. And here's the thing, I didn't know what to do because they're like, all right, go over there and go with Nana. So I didn't see Nana there, so I was like, I don't know what to do. So I started calling them and they were like, boarding ending. I was like, what? Oh my God. So uh, my dad got there and I was like, I didn't know what to do. And he was like, it's fine, I'll talk to them. It's like, you just need, you just need to talk to them. You're holding your carrot like a cigar right now. <laughs> 
<laughs> go ahead. Uh, but you just need to talk to them. I was like, all right, I should have done that. Because, I don't know, I'm a bad talker. Yeah, you are. Even though we have podcasts. <laughs> uh, but um, we talked to them, and it was like, all right, we're going to get you on the plane. We're going to get you on the last seats available. So we're all, like, spread across the plane. Wow. Yeah. So... That sucks. Were you sitting by a stranger? I was, but she was nice, so it was fine. Uh, I kept apologizing because I kind of like rudely went in there. I was like, I'm so sorry. We are in such a rush. They were like, it's fine, you know? Yeah. And um, I got pretzels. Oh, okay. So, oh, yeah. yeah, I ate your Alaskan pretzels. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They, they, uh, they're good. Mm-hmm. So. Dora hates pretzels for some goddamn reason. I don't know why. Pretzels bread. are it's just gift. salty bread. They're good. It combines two things, bread and salt, and makes it better. Both of which she enjoys. Yeah. And then, sometimes, occasionally, you get that third ingredient, peanut butter. Peanut slap butter. Slap that which, shit you right know, in there and then eat that. I mean, there you go. It's the best food ever. So what, what else is bad about the flight? Uh... Or that's, is that it? That's pretty much it. Okay. Food was decent. Yeah. Yeah. Had a lot of fish and chips. Oh, really? Yeah. They like that in the last Yeah. One. And a good burger, apparently. Yeah. Sponsored by Fish and Chips and Burgers. Fish and Chip Burger. So all you people that run Fish and Chip Burger <laughs> restaurants out there. Hook it up. You know, you know who to talk to. See, we're going to get all these, like, really niche, random sponsors... And that's going to be so much better than like Nike or whatever. I don't know why like Nike is a sponsor video game company. But. Mm-hmm. So uh, we 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 get some special gloves for our EA uh, esports gamers. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Dora and I have decided what we're doing um, after high school. Yeah. I'm gonna fail this year, so that I'll stay behind with her. We're we're moving to France. Oh, dude. And um, you should come. You can, like, we can get a little apartment. You can, like, be our next-door neighbor. Can, can I get a gondola? Art. Heck yeah, dude. Yeah. What else are you going to do in France? I'll become an Eiffel Tower tour guy. <laughs> <laughs> Even though I'm like, I've you, never been here before. You could so. just be the Eiffel Tower. Yeah, I could be. Mm-hmm. I could be. The, <laughs> that's what I'm going to do I can wear one of those French, French hats and be like, I'm an artist. Deal yeah. with it. And then people would just throw money at me. I bet they would. Yeah. I bet you they would. My canvas is me. Yeah. Say that and fucking just like have that written in French and have it on a cardboard sign. Mm-hmm. You just sit out there with a paint, with paint and like a palette and just like painting like nothing on me mm-hmm. and just have paint on there and let it dry. Yeah. That's how you That's make money. That's a great kids. idea. So I'm going to be the Eiffel Tower. Mm-hmm. <laughs> You're going to be a human canvas, mm-hmm. and uh, she'll be a French model. I'm going to the middle of the room. Bye. I'll uh, call you back when we Okay. I have no idea what she said. What did she say? What? She said something. She's going where? Low mail. Oh. I lied. This root view is actually pretty good. I like it. Yeah, I got accustomed to it. Mm-hmm. Like many things in life. Okay. Right. Yeah. Right. Getting paid in French money <laughs> and baguettes. Freaking! I I ain't, I don't speak baguette. <laughs> I thought it was croissant. Mmm. It's both. Yeah. It's, so I'm, I'm people, bilingual. All you, I speak baguette and croissant. <laughs> all you people that run baguette and croissant companies, <laughs> hook us up. You know who to talk to. Wait, they have to listen to this first. Put all those tags <laughs> in your Facebook post. So what? We had fish and chip burgers, mosquitoes and bug spray, uh-huh. jackets, uh-huh. and all the accessories. What was that one I just said? Baguettes. And Bag- yeah. <laughs> uh, hashtags. I'll put, I'll put it on Facebook. Uh-huh. I'll get the attention of all those companies. There you go. Told you it'd be good for something. Mm-hmm. So we're at thirty minutes. How long? These usually last for about an hour. Sometimes I edit them. Sometimes I'm not gonna edit these anymore. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm gonna edit these points that I. Yeah. Yeah. All right. But uh, let's see. So what's coming for IJU, Snyder? 
Why well, don't you tell the good people. I actually well, found a game that we should play. Yeah. It looks incredible. It is okay. called. Okay. You know, I I don't think we have much to talk about. What anything you've seen? What? Like anything you want to talk about to finish off? <laughs> I'm just, we're gonna in bar and say like stuff that we're gonna do. Oh, am I supposed to say no? I mean, you could, but we could we could just talk about anything. Like, do you have anything that's been on your mind, pressing your buttons? I was about to tell you about that game. That yeah, but we're gonna, oh yeah, yeah, go ahead. So it's this game. Yeah. And it's called Layers of Fear. Yeah. And you're an artist, I think? Or you're in the mansion of an artist. Yeah. Um, and there are paintings all over the house. And, um,. You go through the, it's a survival horror. And you go through and like as you keep going and you find more clues and you enter more rooms, the the paintings start getting really weird. Like just wrong and off. Something's off about them. And they start like They didn't use the right color theory. Right. Mm -hmm. And their shading is off. Mm -hmm. So they get like the images start getting distorted and then things start coming into the house. Maybe out of the paintings? I'm not sure. I didn't uh. I didn't see that much of it. Hmm. And so it's like survival horror, run and hide, you know, creepy shit. Mm -hmm. So it's a mixture of amnesia and outlast. Hmm. It's okay. it looks really cool. Okay. I actually had a dream mm -hmm. that I was in that game. Huh. And but it was like it was like a Halloween haunted house. And I was, it was my job to scare people, but it was hmm. like based in that game. Hmm. It was neat. It was cool. I keep having dreams about like my parents talking to me about college. <laughs> but they're so Damn. realistic that I think they're real. Damn. But the good thing is that when I wake up, I'm at the other house. Like if I'm at my dad's, I'm at my mom's house when I wake up, and it's yeah. the other way around. Uh, so I know they're not real. That's the thing. Oh, okay. I hope. Yeah. That's stressful either way. Yeah. God, college. It's scary. It's scary. Yeah. Not Colleges, either. if you want to sponsor. <laughs> <laughs> Layers of fear. <coughs> Simon's dad's house and mom's house. Yeah. If you want to sponsor us, you know who to talk to. Hit, hook us up at 256-777-6666. Really? Your phone no. Number? Oh, okay. You don't know my phone number by heart? Oh, do you know mine? No. Okay. Exactly. <laughs> Fair enough. I don't even know Dora's. Exactly. I, I know two phone numbers. Mm -hmm. Mine and my mother's. <laughs> well, and my dad's. I know like four. Okay.